<laughs> this is gonna be funny. All right, guys, we're back here at AMA 2019, and we've got Mike Greenshields. Uh, those of you who've been in the hobby a while, you'll remember a, a hobby shop called Hobby Shack was huge in the in the California area, but they would, did a lot of mail order and stuff like that through the magazines, and then became Hobby People. And unfortunately, that company's kind of gone away, but we still got Mike, so life is good. And he started his uh, company. Why don't you tell us about your company there, Mike? So Mike Goes Flying started as a blog, uh, just had content or whatever, and after hobby people closed, I just needed to be in the hobby. I just, from an industry standpoint, I really enjoy our industry and supplying hobby stuff. Mm -hmm. So my dad and I and my two sons started MikeGoesFlying.com, reworked as a retail website. So we're just online. We don't have a hobby shop. We're just online. And the backbone of what we were doing was importing uh, Magnum engines, much like hobby people, Magnum engines has closed. Um, they went bankrupt a few months ago. So I love selling model engines. I love flying regular glow engines. Um, SH is in Taiwan. They've been making car engines forever. Uh, if anybody remembers, the original XTM 24-7 was actually made by SH engines. So I went to the owner, Henry, and proposed working together. And what we our starting with here is a very simple little line of two strokes. Um, but there's two things that kind of stand out for me. One, they've got an 07, which is unusual. Um, and we'll be releasing that uh, in full version in uh, February. We have 16s and 32s that are coming in today, actually. But the other thing that's really unique, I, I, I just think everybody's going to love this. This is a 37, so it's like a 40 size engine, but it's gas. Not only is it gas, it doesn't require any ignition. So this, this operates just like a glow engine. So you put the igniter on it, you fire it up, tune it up, and off you go. There's nothing on board to carry around. So you have the power to weight ratio advantage that you would with glow, only it's in gas. And it's also vastly more efficient. So a six ounce tank runs for like 15 to 17 minutes on a 10-6 prop. Uh, we're flying 40 size trainers with them, ugly sticks, stuff like that. They, they work fantastic. It's, it's actually shocking how well they work. That's, that's really cool. So you're not carrying ignition, I like that. Uh, running regular pump gas, mixing with two stroke oil, or, or how are you using the gas? Yeah, so it's a 20 to one ratio. We're using red line. Okay. And then once it's broken in, you can go to like maybe 24 to one. You can lighten up the oil a little bit. Okay, so a little heavier on the oil than we use in the giant scale, but that that's pretty cool. We're gonna have to check that out for sure. And uh, as I'm sure a lot of our viewers know, John and I are familiar with with where you're at when the company you're working with goes away, and you kind of just you want to be involved in the hobby still. So that that's really cool to see. So I see you have some other small planes here and everything. We'll get some uh, B-roll of that for the intro. But you want anything you want to tell us about in the plane area? Yeah. So Mike goes flying long term. Our goal is to be a full line supplier of hobby stuff. Okay. Um, <clears throat> where we've started is, uh, besides our own products, is uh, Thunderbolt glow plugs. If you remember those from Hobby People days, we have that full line. Um, RC longs are, are huge. I didn't even realize how many people desperately wanted an RC long, and we have them. Um, but we also got Sonictronics and McDaniels, and we started working with HRP Distributing. Uh, which they sell to dealers all over the country. And they've got a great line of foam airplanes. And I think a lot of people don't even know they exist, honestly speaking. And they're gorgeous. I mean, scale detailing, they're, they're just a lot of fun. So we're offering the, the full line of HRP. Very cool. We'll check out some of the HRP stuff. Maybe we can do a review of one on a video in the future. And in the meantime, guys, check out MikeGoesFlying.com. Support another enthusiast in the industry. And uh, let us know what you think in the comments below.